Good evening, everybody. I'm Christy with your Latino Lubbock update. The third annual Veterans Day Parade is going to be held this week, and joining us to tell us more is our co-chair, Mr. Benny Guerrero of Los Hermanos Familia, and he's the commander of the VFW. It's a mouthful. Oh, yeah, it is. Oh, hi. I know you do a lot, mm. but first of all, is it too late for folks to sign up for the Veterans Day no, Parade? No, it's never too late. Never, never too, too late, late, right? No, I think, uh, I think we've been talking off, mm -hmm. off air. Uh, it's, we're always uh, last minute, but no, it, you go in, <laughs> sign up. I know you provided the, the link on your website, and I provided it on my website, mm -hmm. so it makes it a little bit easier for people just That's to click right. on there. Uh, if you have any questions, by all means, uh, have them, you can text me or give me a call or email me. We'll figure it out. Well, who should participate in this event? Well, I think every veteran should participate. You shouldn't just sit on the sidelines. You should actually exactly. be to be honored and let the, let the city and the community come out and, and thank you for your service and, and honor and see who the veterans are. You know. But we also were looking for marching bands. We are looking for student organizations. Yes. Anybody. Yeah, anybody. Anybody that advocates what veterans have done. Yeah, most definitely. I think uh, it's important when a community comes together to, to do this. That's right. Right. We're still looking for a marching band, right? Yeah, we're still looking for a marching band. I could be that. I'm telling I know. me and Marley can knock <laughs> it out. <laughs> but now this year's theme is so important to us. Yes. Talk about that. Well, this theme, I know that when you and I sat and the team sat together, mm -hmm. I think that uh, Never Forgotten was probably the, the one that we hit. Never Forgotten. Yes. It's the 100th year of Armistice Day, the mm -hmm. war to end all wars, and we know how that had turned out. Uh, uh, we've been bailing out people uh, around, uh, countries around the world, and mm -hmm. it's the American fighting uh, men and women that go out and do these things so why not honor them on veterans day and never forgotten is that thing never forget that's right we can't forget what these men and women have done for us it's so important now we talked a little bit about or we even heard joe talk a little yeah. bit about our missus day and it's really significant but we're encouraging if you're a participant yeah. or if you're on the sidelines to bring american flags yeah. and really show that that pageantry and yeah. just go all out you know yeah I think we have a lot to celebrate. Our freedoms are really important. Now, the other thing is the route we start at. We start at the at the uh, parking lot of First Baptist Church on Broadway and mm -hmm. Avenue UV. Historic you, Broadway. You know, it is. I'm telling you. Uh, funny. I, I offline, you not need to share the story. <laughs> but yeah, and then once we get there, we're going to start on Broadway mm -hmm. and head uh, east on Broadway. Uh, at a slow pace, mm -hmm. and uh, some of our elders will be walking, some of our veterans will be on, on the floor, but all the way to Avenue M. And Avenue M, uh, we're making a left into the Civic Center and, uh, you know, giving each other high fives. That's right. Yeah. We take a lot of pictures. Yeah. It does start at 10 a.m. sharp, and of course, the weather is going to be beautiful. We're already yeah. seeing that it's going to be gorgeous, and look at what we we're expecting 41 degrees. Abundant sun is what yeah. I'm hearing, and it's just going to be beautiful. But once again, the Veterans Day Parade will take place this Saturday, November the 10th, and it starts at 10 a.m. on Historic Broadway. You have to be there if you are interested in participating, loshermanosfamilia.org forward slash veteran dash s dash day dot parade. And then, of course, you can find more details in this month's issue of Latino Lubbock Magazine on Stands Now and Honoring Our Veterans. With that, everybody, have a great weekend. Stay warm and God bless. Now back to more Trends and Friends.